it's Megan Potcakes and today is Pusheen Fall Unboxing Day and something that ex excites me about this box in particular is its size. Here is a standard size box and here's this one. Look at it. It's like twice the height. So I'm really curious if there's like a larger clothing item or something inside. I've seen one of the spoiler items, which is the vinyl. I don't remember the other one if I've seen it. And first thing to note is of course it is zombie or Frankenstein Pusheen. I like to think of her as Frankenshein because she's got that stitched on head, which to me is more Frankenstein's monster than a zombie. But anyway, let's go on and get into it. Ah! First of all, best card ever. I love little witch, Bushy Dead Witch Stormy. I'm putting this in a little frame for this month. But the, there's a plush and it's wonderful. It's glittery. Oh my, let, wait, let's plump her up a little. Okay. She's a candy corn and she's sparkly in the middle. Oh, I love her so much. And if you guys collected the blind box series, there was a little tiny one that was a candy corn like this. But oh my gosh, this is probably my favorite fall plush that they've done. Hands down. I love her. Oh my gosh, like this box is seriously all Halloween themed and that's really exciting because, um, and I would recommend watching my fall unboxing from last year. It had nothing to do with the season, which was like kind of a bummer. Uh oh, sorry, I should probably show you what this is before I open it. It is a set of Bat Sheen sticky notes and it's like a really good size too. Uh, Two years ago, the fall theme was just fall, and there was that really cute shower curtain and everything. So it didn't have anything Halloween related. Wow, I love this. I mean, and that's like a, a decent amount of notes too. Very cool. Oh my gosh, so random that I, I will use this. It is in the color scheme of the Frankenstein, a purple and green hand little sweeper thing. It's got some blue sheens here. I actually use these to clean up my craft table, the kitchen table, like they're super handy. I'm sure people can use these to sweep up cat litter. I mean, that would be super appropriate. Did you steal on my pushing? He has a new chin rest. Mm. Should we go, should we go? Oh my gosh. <gasps> No way, no way, oh my gosh. It is a Pusheen hoodie, costume hoodie, and here's the head, here's the front, and the back has little bat wings. What? Oh my gosh, and it's super lightweight, which is really great for layering. This might be one of my favorite clothing items they've had. Oh my gosh. So it's like your Halloween costume comes with the box. Wonderful. The, that is a very nice surprise. Awesome. I see another cloth item. Purple machine. I can't tell what this is. Still can't tell what this is. Oh my gosh, I'm actually gonna need the card. Take your necessities on the go in this drawstring pouch. The pouch opens flat for easy visibility. You know me, half the time I I open things on this channel and I just get really confused. Two thousand years later. Now I, I'm I just don't really know what to do with this. And it's a pouch. It shouldn't like be complicated. I don't get it, so Eh, on this one. Ah, what? It's a mug. Oh, it's a heat changing mug. And it's awesome. Here's the design. But let me open it real quick. Oh, so here's Pusheen 
just reading her witchy spell book. But then when it's hot, the rest will fill in. So I'll insert a clip here of me adding some hot water and we can see what the design looks like. Oh, look at that. Meowjik. And the top bit's taken a little bit. Oh, look at the sparkles are coming out. Ooh. Uh, something to make sure you're aware of with mugs like this, they're not dishwasher safe. So you have to hand wash them. Ah, so cute. Here's the vinyl. And see, it does say zombie. Zombies don't stitch their body parts on because they're like humans who've come back from the dead with like the zombie disease. Whereas Frankenstein had to stitch together a bunch of body parts to make his monster, so. Oh my gosh, their feet, hands are like this. Mm, oh, she's about to terrorize the village. You better watch out. I have a little Halloween display with my pooshins, and so she'll, she'll fit like right in with the gang. And this last item, it's a pooshin candy holder. For your sweets and treats. I mean, it, it's really an anything holder, not just candy. Look at this. It is a little plastic canister. And she's got her little candies. I mean, I would use this for toiletries. I would use this for party snacks. Or just a whole freaking butt ton of candy corn. So that is everything for the 2019 Pushing Fall Box. I loved it. Let me know what your favorite item was. And thank you so much for watching. Have a magical day. Bye.